Hello guys, and it's Emerald Girl 101 here, and I have something serious to talk about. Uh, yeah, and that I want to help the world with, and at least try to, but I'm not sure if that can happen because of what we've been doing. But in the world, there's some people that, well, they don't have privileges that we have and they they don't have a roof over their head they don't have anything they're living on the streets you pass them not even helping them and some of them are getting weaker by the minute oh, oh, without any food or anything nothing ready and we pass them and they're just trying to get help, right? And it's, it's not right at find that we have, we were born with privileges and we don't notice that we were unlucky, like we're so lucky compared to the people out there that don't have very much. And It's, it's not cool, it's just like, you see them, you walk past them. It's like, there's t children out there that don't have a family, and they're on the streets. I know there's a lot of people out there, and there's a lot of us. But, come on guys, we can at least help them. Don't just say, oh yeah, I'm just gonna forget about them. Actually give them something. They've, they don't have much, and some of them don't even have clothes, like, they're gonna freeze, they, they don't have much, guys, and it's kind of weird how I'm saying this, because I actually passed a guy wanting, some of them are usually, you know, like, in the middle of streets, asking cars and stuff. Mm. Well, if they say they need help, help them. You're not just not gonna stand there and say, oh yeah, that guy might die from starvation or freezing, but I'm just gonna pass them, right? Have you ever thought of it that way? Ever thought that someone could die from you just walking past them? I know it sounds weird, but <laughs> it's out there, guys. And there's many people in pain from it, and they don't have and everything we have. They don't even, they don't have anything. I know I'm saying a couple lines over and over again, but they just need help. They... They just be next time you walk by someone I'm trying to say is that you've made them feel like life isn't worth living really and that there's really nothing left and you see a world we like worlds like, we live in the world, we find it great, right? They're starving, and they don't have the same thing we have, and they're literally just people that live on the streets, we know, but they used oh. to be so amazing, <laughs> and we've made them turn into, like, We've taken away their homes, we've done everything, but see, guys, I'm just trying to say we can change it and turn this world around. And let me say, this is serious. You guys that have a computer, a roof over your head right now, they don't. And they don't think anyone's gonna help them, unless if you do. 
give them food or something. Give them anything. They need it. So do this for Emerald Girl 101 yeah. before they shrink and be no more. Nothing more than nothing. Before they're unhealthy, before they're gone. Picture someone in your family lost everything and more like this. Total misery. Would you help them? Or would you not? This is Emerald Girl 101. And I'm telling you to help before it's too late. Peace out, miners, and keep on mining. And help someone else for a change. And let them get their whole restore back. And let them actually live a normal oh, life. Move a bit. Have everything back to normal. Have fun again and live a normal life. Just like everyone else. Bring them back to joy in what they had. And you're gonna let them do that, aren't you guys? I'm gonna let them live again, as you can say. And you can get this on the Sims 4 website if you like, like him. His name is gonna be Help. In need. Come on, guys. You know we can do this. Now come on, miners. Let's change the world. See you guys. Bye.